As you go through this course today, there's going to be things that you will learn that you can't do. There'll be things that you'll learn that you've been doing right. I commend you on the things you're doing right and the things you're doing wrong. We're going to what? Face it, fix it, and forget it. And some of you have been wondering for years why your church is not growing. Some of you have been wondering why your ministry is not growing. I may have an answer for you today, and that's because God cannot bless a mess. I have over 3,500 churches that I represent across this nation, some of the largest in America, some of the smallest in America. We represent those churches, and we've found one thing in common. There's a common denominator, and that is when they get their house of worship in order complying with all the rules and regulations of the IRS, guess what? God begins to bless that ministry like you've never seen before. God will take you to a level that you've never thought you could go to. It doesn't make any difference what your board told you to put on there because we know what board members know about this. I don't know about you, but I'm starting to feel the Holy Ghost in this house today, and it's only because I'm excited about you getting your house of worship in order because I know what God can do when you get that house in order. I've seen Him take churches to thousands of people, to millions of dollars worth of budget that you could throw into the ministry to help people, and that's what this is all about, is being able to help people do what they can do best. Dream bigger dreams, accomplish something in life that they want to accomplish. If you ever want to have something you've never had, you got to do something you've never done.